What's cranking YouTube? It's your boy Jimmy Conway here. Today we're gonna to be looking at a little mini toy haul that I did for the first week of May 2015. Um, first off, let's see what should I start off first. So lately I've been digging a lot of DC figures. I'm mainly a big Batman fan, but I don't know, man. I've been seeing other figures that I like, other than you know some figures that characters are actually do not have any knowledge about that much so first off this i'm gonna start off with this dc superheroes superman i guess it's, that's the name of the way of the series dc superheroes yeah man this, this guy looks awesome looks pretty good um, let's take a look at the front right here so it does come with a comic book it does not come with any stands i will do a review on this guy you guys are you know curious about this figure just let me know leave a comment below um this bizarre looks pretty neat i'm thinking about see if i can find it online or something so i'm pretty sure these don't come out on retail no more because the year on it says see what was the year i seen it the other day that was the year 2010 yeah so uh, these don't come out super Bruno looks nice too you guys can see her, she's right, right up there, boom, and Doomsday, looks kind of funky, I don't know if you ask me, he looks like a freaking monster from the Japanese, from a Japanese movie or something, so yeah man, so, first that's Superman, and for Star Wars, I do, I mean, I'm, I love Star Wars, yeah, I can't forget about Star Wars. I picked up this mint on card, Sand Trooper. I got this on a pretty good deal, man. This one's going to stay in the card. I don't know, man. I don't know if I should open it because it does have a little... See that? Like, it, like it, it wants to bend all the way, but it's not yet. So, I don't know. I'm thinking about just opening them up or... I don't know, man. It hasn't even been... It hasn't even been... Uh, what do they call it? Puncture? I don't know. Hasn't even been punched yet. So yeah, man, so I don't know. Thinking about even knowing in the car. Buying the little um the little cases for it. So yeah, man. And next I got these from the I got these from the Star Wars Revenge of the Sith movie storyline. I picked up two of them are the same. So let's start off with the, I guess the Vader's Legion Tactical Ops number 65. So I got two of these bad boys. Boom. I, I, I like these figures, man. I seen them. I forgot where I seen them, man. Seen on somebody's video or something. Somebody's collection or diorama. And I liked how they seem, man. I liked how they seem, then. Yeah, they look right to me, so I picked them up. I got them on a pretty good deal, man. I got them both for less than 20 bucks, so. I think it's like 7 bucks a piece. But yeah, man, pretty cool. Um, I'm happy to see these. I will do a review on one of these, so. You guys can see if you guys don't have these figures. I, you know. But definitely, man, if you guys don't have it, I definitely suggest that you pick them up. Just by looking at them from outside the box. They look badass, man, so. That's that for Star Wars. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, last but not least, I got finally I was able to get this guy. I've been wanting to get this guy. His name is Commander Bly. He's pretty badass, man. When it comes to Commander Clone Commanders, Arc Troopers, man, I got a soft spot for them, man. I I'm a sucker for them. They're badass, man. Look at that, look at that little artwork up there of them. It looks pretty badass. There's a few others that I need to get. There's like a gray one. There's a few one. There's a few others, but I will pick them up. I mean, I I love I like I love Jedi's. Don't get me wrong, but when it comes to soldiers, like you know the troopers, like they just got a special place in me, Coruscant, because I grew up liking Joes and anything. I mean, I I always, I, I grew up liking X Men, different stuff, uh, but. When it came to like guns and like military stuff that had like a special spot, you know that that that's what always won me as a kid, like GI Joe and stuff. 
that's why Cable is one of my favorite. Because, you know, he's got powers and he uses firearms and stuff. Yeah, man. So, up next for Marvel, I went to my local comic shop. And I think they got a t-shirt for the for the day that the for May 1st when the Avengers came up. So and I saw and I saw this figure, man. So I had to pick him up, man. He looks badass. Twenty bucks. I probably could have got a better deal online, but I checked and I didn't see much, you know. So yeah, man. Pretty good deal. I think I I looked at Amazon, eBay. I didn't really see nothing else, you know, but better, you know, comparison. So I thought it was cheap if I just bought it there. Plus I'm the type, you know, I like to support, you know, local businesses, you know what I mean? Because the internet is shutting down a lot of people, so making, unending their business. Damn, that's a pretty cool thing. I will do a review on this one too. I got a few things I got to review. They're on their way. It's all coming. Um, you know, I got two kids. I'm busy, you know, I got a, I got a life other than this, you know, but this is a hobby. I like doing this, man. This, this collecting hobby, it's it really gets my mind off a lot of shit that goes on, you know? So, yeah, man. We'll do a review on these. Next up, I got two new figures. I got these on eBay for pretty cheap price. And I like to collect loose figures. I like to display, you know, I, I don't mind buying loose figures as long as I don't look all jacked up. So, let's start off with this juggernaut, man. Finally, I got my hands on. Oh, I actually got one on card, but yeah, you know, you always gotta have doubles. I I rather have doubles of the ones I really like, like my favorite villains or characters. You know what I mean? So this figure is pretty awesome. And also, I got this Captain America. It did not come with the base, and it did not come with the shield. And that's what I was trying to. I was trying to figure out if maybe I can find a, you know. Does he, I don't even care if it's a bad action figure. I just need a, a shield. Maybe I was, I was thinking about buying a Captain America. Even if the figure is bad, I would just use the shield for it. So if you guys can recommend me a shield for the 3.75 three, three inch Marvel Universe. I think this is the ultimate Captain America. I need a shield for him, man. So if you guys can recommend me a good shield. Inside and out, that can go on his back, maybe it has the handles. Maybe that's not possible. I think that's only for the Marvel Legends, but yeah, man. If you guys can you know, leave a comment below, you know, sh shoot me a hint on wh what shield is best or go best with this figure. I will definitely will look into it and appreciate your response. All right, so yeah, man. So you guys will see a, a um. We'll see a review on all these figures. I just it just takes time, you know what I mean? Busy dude. Um figure better better be but yeah man, this is all I got for now. I think this thing's in the mail, you guys will see reviews. Oh, this one even let me do a size comparison. Star Lord and Juggernaut. Just a little bit shorter than him. And here he is next to the ultimate cap. They're about the same. I think Captain America is a little taller, but his knees are kind of like bent. There we go. Yeah, Captain America is definitely taller. But he's a good figure, man. All these figures right here, if you don't have them, you got to get them, man. They're all badass, dude. Oh, that Superman, I haven't got to open it. But just by the looks of it, it looks badass. Um, so yeah, man, that's it for this toy haul video. You guys know what to do. Comment, like, subscribe. Please do leave a comment below about the shield on this figure on the Captain America. That would, I would, that would really help. I would really highly appreciate it. But yeah, man. And another thing is, I wanted to add on to this video is, um, I got an extra and Zolo in the Stormtrooper disguise. If anybody wants to train, leave a comment below. You can work something out if you don't have them yet, if you're dying to have them, or whatever. I mean, you can, we can trade equal, you know, with the equal price range or what, whatnot, or, yeah, so just let me know. 
I don't mind trading like loose figures need as long as they're not destroyed or as long as they're good in good condition and we can just talk from there. You know, I'm willing to help. So yep, that's it for this video. Peace out. Bye.